Now, a big, important part, Cheetah the Chimp. And Cheetah was a big, big part of that ensemble. And for comic relief, Cheetah was the primary comic relief. What's the matter, Cheetah? Very becoming, too. <laughs> Cheetah was just great comic relief and great fun. Cheetah was always up to some mischief, but usually somewhere in the movie, Cheetah would also come to the aid of Tarzan or help rally the elephants or something to get Tarzan or the family out of some trouble. My uncle, Tony Gentry, was a big animal trainer in Hollywood and for the studios MGM and many other studios throughout the years back in the 30s, 40s, and, and, and 50s. But his main thing was the chimps, and, and, and he, he loved the chimps. Now, Cheetah, that the name of the chimp, was strictly an MGM concoction. This was not from Burroughs. Cheetah was an original MGM creation. In the Tarzan novels, Tarzan's companion is a small monkey named Nakima. Interestingly enough, Burroughs never even mentioned chimpanzees in his novels, and he never, in any of his correspondence, gave a reason for the oversight. Cheetah! Cheetah, come back! The monkeys, they're, they're nice for, till they're about three years old, and then do they get mean. There, there, Cheetah. That's all right. You can go with me. Cheetah never cared for Jane much because he was jealous of Maureen. And the only reason is, is because Cheetah was raised by my uncle. He was used to the male figure around him uh, 24 hours a day. One still I wish I had with me, it's very funny. There's uh, myself, and then there's Boy, then there's Johnny, holding Cheetah's hand. And Cheetah has one leg out of the, out of the, out of the picture. You know why? Because she was, that one leg was tied by a chain so that she couldn't get at me. She'd have killed me if she could. She was so in love with Johnny and hated me so much. One of the Cheetahs that worked with Johnny Weissmuller in the MGM series is still alive. My Uncle Tony had four chimps that played the part of Cheetah in the picture business, and uh, Cheetah here is the last living one today at the age of 71 years old, will be 72 in April, and he holds the Guinness World Record of the oldest primate in the world, which we're very excited about because uh, the normal lifespan in, in captivity is around 50, uh, in the wild is 40, 45. And she just done about 12 Tarzan pictures throughout the years. The last picture he did was Dr. Doolittle with Rex Harrison. That was in 1967. We, we, we go for walks here in town and, um, uh, and across the street in the desert and whatever. You know, we live here in the desert and he plays the piano. He likes to play the piano. Play pretty. Play. We'll change the tune a little. Change it Yeah, he plays piano. I mean, you know, it's his own tune. You like that? Okay, I'm going to give him something. That's a good boy. Okay. When I'm doing stuff around the facility here, he's with me a lot. And uh, uh, in the afternoon, he loves to go for rides. We have a little electric car now. He loves to ride in. Of course, he loves to ride in anything. And uh, we go for rides. He loves to ride around town and go in for a, a, um, a sandwich someplace, you know, through a drive through I'm treating him like my uncle treated him. He was, he's in the house. He goes for rides. He's part of the family because that's what he's used to, and that's what mentally... Uh, is healthy for him.